Wait, what? Why haven't I heard this before? I saw on the actress who played Bian, Jolie Rappaport's story on Instagram just recently. Someone asked her what her thoughts on Watchmen being cancelled are. And I was like, what? Is Watchmen cancelled? I did some research and it has been known for a while now. Why haven't I heard this before? So the reason Watchmen isn't continuing is largely because creator Damon Lindelof isn't interested in doing it. There are also reports saying that the show wasn't cancelled, wasn't actually cancelled because of its success, but rather the network accepted the creative team's decision not to continue the story. Programming chief Casey Blois broke the news that HBO won't be pursuing a second season without little love's involvement. Quote, It's really in Damon's thinking about what he wants to do. If there's an idea that excited him, another season, another installment, maybe like Fargo, True Detective, an anthology series, take on it. Or if he wants to do something different altogether. We are very proud of Watchmen, but what I'm most interested in, what Damon wants to do. It would be hard to imagine doing it without Damon involved in some way. End quote. Lindelof has indicated to news outlets that the story he wanted to tell is complete. Though according to USA Today, he has given his blessing for HBO to continue the show without him. The last episode of Watchmen wrapped up most of the outstanding story threads, with the exception of some deliberate ambiguity in the episode's final moments. But is Angela the new Dr. Manhattan? Is he still alive? They are some of the questions that we might never get answered. For its part, HBO could have looked at Watchmen as the answer to the Game of Thrones size hole in its programming slate. Watchmen's success brought the network some goodwill that it needs before going into 2020, which we will see the launch of HBO Max. Putting art before commerce might be inconvenient for HBO, but continuing without little of is even more risky, especially given HBO's history with disappointing second seasons. After the way Lost ended, which which had Damon Lindelof as the creator and the writer. Maybe this ending is better uh, than the way he ended Lost.